Another stunning sunrise. The afternoon before, we went for a bit of a walk to try and find a great spot. We found an awesome spot just up on the rocks where there was a, a right on the edge of the weed bed where it'd be great for squid and also some nice whitewash for some tailor. There were also scales everywhere, which is always a good sign. Um, had it all planned out, rigged up to what we thought we were going to go for. Woke up and it was about a 30 kilometer wind in the wrong direction. We wouldn't be able to cast a squid jig more than 10 meters in front of us. Luckily we got up early and had a look in Google Maps and found a beach not too far away which we could also walk to. And this was going to be a little bit more out of the wind. It did mean that we had to change it up a little bit um, and we had to use, I guess, heavier metals to sort of get out into the target area because we were planning to fish off the rocks. And of course for the heavier metal I'm using the classic Savage Gear missile. I think I picked up about 20 of these from the bargain bin. They're about $2 each. Perfect. Caught a shitload of tailor in my time on them. Also a lot of herring as well. I was out here using the Veritas 7 foot, 4 to 8 kilo. Fantastic rod. And a 20 pound braid on a Stratic 5000. We're hoping to pick up maybe a few tailor, even some Australian salmon. On the beach I was rotating between casting into a gutter to my right and then towards the rocks on my left. And there was a, quite a lot of nice whitewash which was very tailorish. There was not a skerrick of seaweed on this beach, so I was casting out, letting it sink to the bottom, and then ripping it back. With it being 42 grams, it sunk to the bottom pretty quickly as well. We were trying to use a few lighter lures, but because there was a lot of whitewash, they were just not getting right behind the breakers, and also um, uh, it was they were getting pushed around in the surf too much. So the 42, 50 gram lures were doing much better. Nice strong hookup, and it was taking a bit of line. Felt very different to a tailor. I thought originally it would be a Australian salmon. Didn't have a huge amount of weight, but it was very powerful. I'd already lost a couple of fish, most likely just small choppers, so I was taking them in nice and easy. Yeah, mate. Here, here it is, mate. Look. My tailor apprentice from the last video oh, was giving me yeah. this one. I wasn't expecting this bonito off the beach, but it was pretty awesome fun for the size. We got a few more 30 to 40 centimetre tailor after this, all caught on the Savage King and so Unfortunately, a bigger fella came along and swallowed the lure. So we came back here the following day and cleaned up. He's going to shake real hard, so hold his tail and then hold underneath there. Yeah, we're right, mate. He's tough. Good job, mate. 